This is Mark Warner with PropertyMortgageInvestment.com and I'm here today to talk to you about a art an article that appeared in the Dallas Morning News recently by Steve Brown, a, a noted columnist in the Dallas Morning News and he talked about that the investors are getting out of the market or not uh, as robust in the market in buying foreclosed homes as they were back in 2005. He talked about the median price back in 2009 Five, when the, the lending institutions had a lot of money to loan, were buying homes and they were paying the prices of around $183,000 on average. Now, investors are able to buy those same properties for like $94,000, but because the lending market has shrunk, there's been a decline in the number of purchases that have been made. Back then in 2005, the percentage of homes that were being purchased through investors was 25%. And now it's down to like 17%. And most of those purchases, or a lot of those purchases, are being purchased by uh, investors who have cash or who do not put any financing on those properties. So the opportunity for investors to go out and pick up bargain properties is uh, replete with numerous properties that somebody could buy if they have the cash and if they have the staying power, which they would by buying them with cash, to hang into the market until such time as it appreciates in value, be able to finance out what they purchased and have some nice equity in their, in their homes. And when you can finance out 100% of your cash investment, you no longer have any risk left in the property and lenders somewhere in the future Everything's cyclical, the money will loosen up, and there'll be great opportunities to buy properties. Now one of the concerns that was expressed in all of this was that there wouldn't be any opportunities to pick up these properties because, or wouldn't want to pick up these properties because the prices of these homes will decline in value. Well, everything's cyclical, number one, and number two, real estate is a long-term investment. So the opportunities to buy, even though the prices might come down a little bit more, nobody knows the bottom, nobody knows the perfect timing, but now's as good a time as any to pick up prices at bargain prices and hold on to them for a long period of time because the prices will come back and will exceed what you're currently able to buy properties for. If you'd like to comment on this, on this video, you can comment by sending an email to askpmi at propertymortgageinvestment.com. This is Mark Warner with propertymortgageinvestment.com.